Hey guys, welcome to your uh, bonus energy check-in. This is going to be for Taurus for the um, for the uh, rest of your February. Uh, you can apply this to any of your placements because uh, anything can come up. So we're going to take a look at your over energies, what's surrounding you guys, what you guys need to know, what you guys could expect for the rest of February. And then we'll finish off for you to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situations. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are personal messages for the collective towards people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. Uh, if you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Uh, support me on there too. Uh, also, if you guys didn't know, I am doing uh, a 30-minute free uh, giveaway, uh, thir free 30-minute personal reading with me on Zoom. Um, so if you guys are interested in that giveaway, the details to enter the uh, giveaway is in the uh, community tab, okay? For those of you guys that are entering, good luck. I will announce the winner on March 8th, all right? So, Taurus. Bonus energy check-in for Taurus. Bonus energy check-in for Taurus for February, for the rest of February 2024. For Taurus, we have the four swords here, okay? So I feel like you're in a period of healing and recovery and rest here, okay? King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. You can have any of those energies in your chart here, Taurus. You could be dealing with any of those energies in around you. We have the Page of Pentacles here and the Three of Pentacles, okay? So I feel like you're in this energy of relaxing here. I feel like when it comes to work, I do feel like you might be collaborating with a lot of people here or working with a bunch of people here uh, for the rest of February. So I feel like it's going to be really busy for you guys at work. Um, whatever you guys do here, I do feel like it's in the very, it's in the creative field here, okay? Um, might be some, something that has to do with music or something like that, all right? Music, singing. Uh, if that's not the case, you know, it could be just your, your regular nine to five job, okay? Just keep in mind that these are general messages here. We have the Justice card, Libra energy here, and the Hangman, Piscean energy. One of the things I'm getting here is that, uh, Taurus, I feel like you're finding a lot of st uh, stability and balance at this time here. You know, one of the things I'm getting is I feel like, I feel like you're operating from the place of just going through life without having to, you know, worry about anything surrendering to the process, letting the process unfold as it should here, okay? So uh, it seems like things are looking really good for you guys uh, in a way, uh, and things are uh, looking up in your work because I feel like you guys are about to get really busy here. The Four of Swords here and the Three of Wands. Tell me the King of Cups here and the Tower here. Very Scorpio energy. There could be some unexpected changes here. You know, I do feel like, you know, I feel like you might be head heading towards a, a little bit of rocky water here, okay? Uh, you know, I do feel like it might be, you know, regarding, um, you know, your work here, okay? Uh, you know, it could be a situation that, you know, you might be hearing some sort of unexpected news that, you know, you are, uh, you're going to be traveling for work and that's something that you've never done before. That, that's, that, that's something that you never signed up for. But, you know, I feel like there are surprises, twists and turns that are coming towards you, but I feel like you're kind of like surrendering to the process and just being like, okay, I'm just going to do it. I'm not going to complain about it. I'm just going to put my best foot forward here. The King of Pentacles and the uh, Page of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Three of Pentacles here, and the Knight of Cups here, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Actually, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo with the King, uh, King of Pentacles here. Yeah, so what's happening is I feel like there is a couple of people that's going to be around you that, that you're going to be working a lot here with. I also feel like you're going to be uh, these people's mentors because I do feel like they work under you here. Okay, uh, Justice, Ten of Cups, Judge, uh, Hangman, and um, Temperance, Sagittarius Energy. Things are pretty balanced here. Things are pretty happy, okay? Uh, happy 
kind of living that happy life here. Uh, if you guys are together here with, uh, you know, someone, if you have a family here, okay? But if you guys are single here, I feel like you guys are just doing really well on your own too, all right? Uh, but, you know, um, with the Temperance card and the Four of Swords, I mean, the healing journey that you're on, I mean, you could be just on this journey of just continuing your healing, you know? And just being really committed to it with the Justice card here, okay? What else do we have here for Taurus? What else do we have here for Taurus? What else does Taurus need to know? Look out for work on for um, February. The rest of February 2024 for Taurus. For Taurus. Two of Pentacles here and the Strength card, Leo Energy. Judgment in the Two of Wands. So Taurus, it seems like you have some big decisions to make here moving forward. Yeah, I mean, your job could be offering a position somewhere else in a different town or a different city or a different state here. And I feel like you might be making a decision based on that here. Um, you know, I feel like you are going back and forth here. Um, I do feel like you're trying to be patient with not ma making any harsh or any rash decisions here. I feel like you're taking your time with it. You know, I feel like you've been giving a deadline here. I do feel like you have ample time with this deadline here. The Ten of Pentacles here and the Five of Pentacles. I would say take it. Take this opportunity here because I feel like it will dramatically improve your finances here. Because I feel like if you do take this position, that's taking you kind of like far away from your home uh, where you have to move, I do feel like there will be a huge pay increase for you, okay? But at the end of the day, that's really up to you because, you know, Torrens are not really known to be, you know, to be those type of people that really step out of their, step out of their comfort zone because they're kind of like creature of habits, uh, creature of habit, you know? Uh, but it really depends on each Taurus though. But, you know, I do feel like this is... Um, you know, I do feel like, you know, you're realizing in life all challenges have rewards here. And I feel like this will be the biggest reward, you know, um, to step into here. Uh, the biggest challenge to step into for you guys. The Two of Pentacles here and the Six of Pentacles. The Strength card. Why is the Strength card here? Why is the Strength card here? And the Five of Cups. Okay. Six of Pentacles, the Five of Cups here. Yeah, I, I feel like this decision, I feel like you don't want to make any rash decisions here because I feel like you don't want to regret a decision that you're going to make here. You know what I mean? So I feel like you're just really taking your time here. I, I, I actually see you guys choosing to give it a shot. Yeah, I do feel like with the star card here and the uh, uh, judgment card here, I do feel like this is... This is sort of like written in the, st in the stars in a way. I feel like this is supposed to happen or that this is meant to happen. And I feel like your guides and your angels and your ancestors, even the universe is stepping in to say, don't miss out on this opportunity here, you know? So we have the uh, star card. Aquarius energy, three of cups here. I do feel like your friends are also supporting you on this too. It's a sort of like take this, take this chance here, you know? Um, so it's really up to you. You know, whether you want to do this or not. Uh, because I see, yeah, I see some big things happening for you. If you, if you do take this position here, I, I do feel like it will further or, uh, you know, um, kind of like uh, take you, uh, take your career to a whole new level here. The Magician, Gemini, Virgo, the Five of Pentacles here, and the Four of Wands here. I do see happiness, stability, financial fulfillment here. Uh, I do feel like you, t I do see you taking on a bit of a, like a bit of a bigger role here, you know, bigger than the role that you're already at. So, you know, it, like I said, it's really up to you, but it's kind of looking really good here. If this is a, an offer that's coming towards you, okay? So uh, Taurus, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.